out the way we think it should go. And when it doesn't go that way, we get upset and we get irritated. If God literally sent us a letter saying, okay, it's February what, 2nd today? February 2nd. On February 15th, after Valentine's Day, I'm going to send you me. Then towards the end of February, y'all going to go ahead and get married. Like, be like, okay, okay, okay. All God does sometimes is sends us dreams, signs from other people, you know, from, from and it's, it doesn't come with the instructions or it doesn't come with the time on it. So we get impatient and we don't trust it now. Because it's like, okay, I know God said, just like, for example, I had a dream long ago that I was going to carry a child. But what was I doing when we, when we couldn't conceive? Makes you want to try to take it in your own will, your own power. I would cry to get upset. I would have times with you where I was like, I just don't think I can have kids, Ken. I just don't, right? But God clearly showed me when my grandmother, who's gone home to be with the Lord, she was folding clothes, and she said, she's pregnant. I said, Grandma, no, I'm not. Right? So I'm like, hold on, God. Pregnant with what? It's just pregnant with a new album, pregnant with a new, you know, what is this going on? But because he didn't give me instructions and say what day it was going to be, I was very impatient. And that's, I think that a lot of us rock like that. And I think that God wants us to, it's almost like that's where the faith and the trust comes in. You know what I mean? But it's just hard. And I, I dealt with that in the past. I still deal with it now. Cause we went through that with, with little mama until I came to you and said, you know, what, Ken? God showed it to me. And I, I'm, I'm not doing right by 